Hello, and thank you for joining us. Doug Flanders here, Senior Director of American Sales at Red Lion. In Building Block 2, MQTT, we demonstrated how you can utilize our built-in cloud connector to send your data to SCADA, enterprise, or cloud-based system. As we move forward to Building Block 3, we'll demonstrate another standard feature built into Crimson. OPC UA Client Server. Red Lion's OPC UA Client Server capability can simplify your data aggregation. This will enable you to gather data from legacy as well as new devices to enhance your capability to unleash the power of your data. Using the four E's, Crimson provides ease of integration, including easily drag and drop data tags, efficiently access information from multiple OPC UA servers or clients, Effectively provide highly scalable communications between legacy and OPC UA enabled devices. This enables you to share data between multiple RLC and other manufacturers devices. Redline's products can be configured as OPC UA clients, OPC UA server, or OPC UA client and server. They can also be configured to utilize OPC UA HA, sending data to your SD card or removable storage device. OPC UA functionality is available on many devices within the Red Lion portfolio of products, including the Flex Edge, Graphite HMIs and controllers, CR3000 HMIs, and DA10 and DA30 products. Now it's time to pass this over to Joe Slattery, one of our application engineering managers, to demonstrate how Red Lion can simplify your OPC UA implementation using Crypt's software. Thank you. I'm going to dive right in and first demonstrate how to set up the OPC server and connecting to the server with a third-party client. Then I'll demonstrate briefly how to move data between two Red Lion devices using OPC UA. Within Crimson, in the navigation pane, you'll find Services, OPC UA Server. While there are many protocols available that move data, the payload in these protocols may only include the actual data parameters like temperature or state variables. However, with OPC, you'll see how we can configure the data model and enable access to a list of attributes with minimal setup. These features and other features within OPC UA provide a very feature-rich communication environment. Under Service, I'll enable the server, FlexEdge, the network, listening port for OPC UA is 4840 by default. The next section is Browsing. This is where we can define and structure the information that the client can pull out of the Crimson device. In this case, I'll leave the model layout default. I'm gonna change the tag structure to include folders with full names. I'll leave the array layout at default. And I will also select yes with state text on the properties. If you have an application with critical data or you have intermittent network outages, could go into the historical data section and enable record history. This will allow you to retrieve that data at a later time. And last, you can allow writes to the OPC UA server if you wish. I'll now go to Data tab, pull an account value, and also I want to pull a few values out of the Group 1 folder. I'll select Save and Load. So this is the OPC UA client. I've already connected to the server. Within this OPC UA client, if you look at the V1 folder, there will be the tags folder. Within this tags folder, you can see here, group one is already there from the client side. And based on the server configuration, it automatically created a folder within the client. And if I expand on the group one folder, you'll see the MQTT tags, IP tag, and temperature tag that were created on the server side. I do not have the count value in the list yet, so I'll just drag that over. You can see the values for these tags and they're updating continuously. So within Crimson, we enabled the ability to add folders. We also enabled other properties. So if I select an MQTT, for example, you can see the rich set of attributes that come along with each tag. So you can see how intuitive and easy it is to set up OPC UA server on a Red Lion device using Crimson software. Finally, I want to show how easy it is to set up a Red Lion device using OPC UA client to pull the data tags from a Red Lion OPC UA server. First, I'll import the tag file from the OPC UA server project file. I've already exported tags from the server, so I'm going to select import, CSV file, and I'm going to select the Flex Edge server tags. Next, I want to go to communications, protocol, Pick OPC UA client. 
I pre-configured the host name, which is the IP address of the server. Scroll down just a little bit and you'll see auto config feature, download data model from device. Since my laptop is networked to the OPC UA server, I'm gonna hit go. I'll call this flex server tags. Select download. Now that I've completed this, you'll see here under the device, I can expand the folder structure and see that my variables are now addressable on the resource pane. To complete the data mapping, I'll select tag, go to internal, dev1, you can see here my tags are available. I'll expand this down to MQTT, go to the temperature, also go to dev1, and select my temperature value, as well as the IP. And if I want to map the count value, I'll do the same with the count value. In addition to having access to the data from the server, I also have immediate access to the attributes from the server properties. For example, I can monitor the server status from the client if I wish. Using Red Lion devices in combination with OPC UA, you can quickly and easily map values from one device to the other within minutes. Thank you, Joe. Building on what was just demonstrated, I'd like to share a quote from a known user of Crimson Software. They stated, Redline's OPC UA client server functionality and protocol conversion enabled us to communicate to our legacy devices and send the data in a format that was easily recognized by our supervisory system. This allowed us to upgrade our field devices and greatly reduced our costs. In review of our series of ease of use videos of Crimson Software, we've unleashed the power of protocol conversion in MQTT using Crimson. Now we've added the functionality of OPC UA to the list of ease of use capabilities. In our next video, we'll introduce the FlexEdge power of Crimson 3.2, combining networking and automation capabilities into one cutting edge product platform. FlexEdge powered by Crimson 3.2 provides a scalable solution enabling connectivity to virtually anything, anywhere, anytime. Explore the possibilities. Red Lion's Crimson software can be downloaded on our website at www.redlion.net slash crimson or by clicking the link provided here. Thank you for taking the time to explore Red Lion products and solutions. For questions on Red Lion's portfolio of products, please use the information provided on this page or contact one of our authorized distributors.